Hello, and welcome to JeopardyLabs.com tutorial. My name is Ellie Starks. Today, we will learn how to access JeopardyLabs.com, how to create your own free game of Jeopardy, and how to save your game to access when you need it later. So let's get started. To get started, we first need to go and type in JeopardyLabs.com. As you can see in my search bar, it's already been looked at before. Once you hit JeopardyLabs.com, this is the screen that you will see. You see you have two options over here on the left hand side. We can either create a Jeopardy game or find a Jeopardy game. So first we're going to want to create a Jeopardy game. So we're going to click on that button. When you click that, you are going to get this screen to build a Jeopardy template. You just want to create a password easy for you to remember. So that way later on you can go ahead and access your game later to be able to show other people you're creating this game for and then hit start building. So you can go ahead and save the password if you would like. I am not going to. When you get to the screen, you have several different options. So first you want to enter a title for what your Jeopardy lab is going to be. For us today, we can do United States Capitals. And then under each of these rows or columns actually, you want to go ahead and enter what your category is going to be. So you could go East Coast States, Southeast States, Midwest States, Southwest States, and then end off with West Coast States. After you've hit decided on what your column is going to be, you can go ahead and click on each number in a row. So I'm going to click first on the 100 level. And you're going to get a question prompt and then the correct response. The question prompt is typically a phrase that is a statement. So you can see in the example here, the third planet from the sun. And then the way that respondents answer is actually by asking a question. So what is Earth? So we could say, um, Albany, and then they can say, what is the capital of New York? Hit continue. And now, if you were to hit this, it shows what this is. So if you want to go ahead and save your Jeopardy Labs from here, you're going to hit save and finish. And you can also go back, you want to save this link right here that is highlighted because this is a link to actually be able to access your lab. So if you were to click this right here, it'll let you go ahead and start. So United States Capitals, how many teams do we have? We'll say we have two teams today. If you hit start, you have your Jeopardy. Go ahead and click this, Albany. And then up here it shows to reveal your correct response, you're going to hit the space bar. And over here, if you want to continue, you're going to hit your escape button. So I hope that this training tutorial was helpful for you and having to learn how to navigate Jeopardy Labs website. And I hope you learn something new that you can apply to your everyday life. And I hope that you're able to now go ahead and go into Jeopardy Labs and create your own Jeopardy game. Thank you.